strength and conditioning is such a huge part of the process of getting to that point. And so for us, um, in our program, we realized that in order to be great basketball players, you got to be in great shape. Coach Phil has tremendous energy. You know, he, he knows how to compete. Uh, first impression of North Texas, I love it. Um, our guys are awesome. They, they're great, great listeners. Uh, the returners have a great training background, so it hasn't been too hard catching them up. Um, in terms of strength and conditioning and the plan, we're going to run an effort-based program. Real simple, the program doesn't work if you don't work. Do a bunch of change of direction because that's, that's what basketball is all about. The game's played 80% lateral or backwards. Um, we're going to train that way. It will be more, uh, more quick on the court. It helps us uh, be more lenient, be more flexible, not more so uh, a lot of ways, but more so like physical stuff is like what you can do. It's intense. Everybody comes to work. Coach uh, Phil with the strength and conditioning, he's always excited, energetic about the workout. Uh, he has planned for the day and um, everyone is excited to do it. It's gonna get us faster, stronger, obviously. Um, make us jump higher. It's a long season, so the strength and the conditioning is gonna help us in the long run. We're trying to get them as strong as possible and as explosive as possible and make major body composition changes. That's, that's one of the great things about the summers in college basketball is you get about seven or eight weeks to really just train. You don't need to taper for, for a fall season. You can really just go. Three, one, two, three. Yeah.